Hi everyone, welcome to the Diecast Collection with our channel. Here is the 1932 Ford or the 32 Ford by Hot Wheels. This is part of the Mattel Games series. Uh, this is a classic 1932 Ford turned into a hot rod or a customized version to make it look cooler and uh, most likely to have a better performance, especially when it comes to racing. This has been heavily customized. It has an exposed engine and the paint designs uh, spread on the car. This also, being a Mattel game series, uh, features the game Uno, or Uno, or let's just say Uno. And uh, it's a card game, and uh, I only played the game uh, a couple of times uh, way back then, so I'm not uh, familiar with the mechanics anymore. And uh, there's even a wild at the back that might be a variation of the game mechanics. Uh, therefore, uh, it would be uh, uh, hard for me to explain the game mechanics, so I'm going to refer you to the internet to find the game mechanics of the game Uno. But uh, know this, this is uh, one of the games uh, that Mattel has been uh, publishing so far. In addition to uh, the game Uno uh, printed on the car, uh, this is a modified casting. Uh, here's the base. It has uh, two dates, 1997 and uh, 2016. Uh, the 1997 version is the original uh, release, and the 2016 version is the one that we're seeing in the uh, video. The casting change uh, details, you can uh, find it more on the link that I uh, placed in the description, because I don't have an original uh, 1997 version of the car to compare with right now. Uh, you can read more about it and then you can uh, check the photos for comparison of the uh, present car, which is this one, and the previous 1997 car. I'm getting way ahead of myself. Let's take a look at the uh, 1932 Ford in the, uh, what's this, the passenger side uh, on the right. It has the colorful Uno uh, cards. Uh, placed on the side. It has a uh, paint stripe. It's a very thin paint stripe. It's uh, also showing that the uh, red card, that is the number four over here, is the same color as the metal body. Everything red here in the car is made with metal. In the front is the grill that is in front of the engine. I'm not seeing any lights here. Uh, this is a hot rod. Uh, the 1932 Ford, being a classic car, should have uh, circular uh, front lights uh, on the sides. Uh, I'm just uh, thinking, uh, where are they? I'm just going to assume that the lights are these little casting details on the sides of the grill, because this is a let's just, let's just say it's a modernized version of the 1932 Ford becoming a hot rod. So I think the customizer placed uh, square lights instead of the uh, uh, maintaining the circle lights, just like in the uh, photos. The scoop on the top and the uh, windshield that is colored yellow in reference to the yellow card and the uh, yellow color on the uh, Uno uh, logo. The driver's side on the left is pretty much the same as the right side from earlier. It's the paint stripe, the Uno text logo, and the cards at the bottom. With the exposed engine, uh, it has the two pieces. One is the plastic uh, chrome piece that is attached to the uh, front as well. And the, there is a scoop on the top that is part of the metal body. The wheels are of different sizes. Uh, that is appropriate because I saw in the uh, photos of the web with the hot rod versions of the 1932 Ford. They usually have the uh, same uh, setup. Uh, smaller wheels or regular wheels in the front and the uh, thicker and larger wheels at the back. At the back of the uh, Ford, it has a wild paint design at the uh, trunk door that has the different card colors and 
Uh, like I said earlier, I'm not sure about the wild keyword. That might be a new game mechanic, but it might be, a, let's just say, an additional card or something. But it's here at the back. It's uh, uh, plenty of uh, colors at the back of the uh, car. Uh, the additional casting detail at the back, uh, I'm guessing that these slots on the sides, just near the wheels, are the brake lights just on the bumper, and at the center is the license plate holder that I'm guessing. The top of the car uh, does not have uh, paint designs on the roof and the front scoop or the vent of the engine in the front, but it does have lots of details of the engine. It's exposed and it has extensions uh, for the exhausts. The exhausts are coming upwards, and then it's just like a V if you look at it from an angle. The wild uh, paint design at the trunk door, and that's the only paint design at the uh, top. The uh, paint designs are now painted in the sides and the back, nothing in the front, it's all casting details. I show the base, and here's the base again. Uh, nothing much to it except for the uh, dual dates and the uh, chassis details. For the interior, it has a simple one. It has a cushion bench type seat that can hold two people or two people uh, passengers in the car there's a driver's wheel let me see the window is kind of small so i'm gonna tilt a bit there's the driver's wheel here's another angle and the transmission stick in the middle very simple interior there's no console in the front, but we do get to see the uh, yellow uh, clear window, both in the front and the back. It's uh, one piece. The interior is chrome, so it is part of the engine. This ends my video art of the 1932 Ford by Hot Wheels. Thanks for watching, enjoy your collection, and see you with the next model.